All right, so we are in week 13, and we essentially have <clears throat> just two more weeks of assignments like this, and we have one more final, and the final will just be one paper. So finals week will actually be quite easier compared to anything. So it's just really these last two weeks that are going to really be the, the struggle to just finish off, okay? And... Um, you know, I still haven't today. I've not been able to get the um, all of the zeros into the grades yet because I have been pretty busy as well. Uh, many of you, uh, somebody rightfully, you know, messaged me and said, um, "Hey, I noticed you didn't turn like grade my exam yet, and uh, is there a problem?" No, the problem is I just haven't graded it yet. I'm, you know, despite the fact again that I tell you that I don't leave many comments in your papers a, a lot of times. I'm, I am reading them more carefully since it's an exam and making sure um, that if I do need to say something, I am writing something uh, to you, okay? And so, um, you know, some of you, I gave some kind of heavy critiques on your papers. And if you've been keeping up the work, you probably noticed that you didn't really need the points that much. And maybe you don't care that much about what your grade is like on your last final. So that's up to you. And I just kind of actually want to just kind of point that out. For some of you, it may be, I mean, I mean, I give a lot of points, and you may notice that you can afford to not turn in a paper or not. But that's something that's on you. You know, it, if you can calculate the points properly and you know you're good at math <clears throat> and that you feel like you can afford to not turn in an assignment or not do all of it, um, that's up to you. Um, I don't take it personal. Um, I would like it if you let me know you were doing something like that. Like if you just turned in one paper and said, I'm just too busy this week and I'm going to take the zero. So I at least know that there wasn't an accident in terms of um, you know, maybe you, you some, sometimes some of you will mean to send two papers at once and you only sent one. So then I'll just know, okay, and I'll just give you the points based on what you actually sent me. Okay. Um, but uh, yeah, so I, I'm hoping, you know, to get, by the middle of this week, I'll have all the final exams graded. Um, you know, maybe even today. I'm going to try to target by tonight to do it. Um, and like I said, I know we're busy. I mean, it's a beautiful day. I have um, two lovely lady friends of mine asked me to go on a picnic. And um, I'm here being a good, productive citizen. So, yay. So, I'm sure that... Many of you on a lovely day like today would rather be doing something else and are stuck. And I just want you to know, as your professor, I feel your pain. You know, I am. Um, um, but, you know, rewards come to those who prioritize. It's good when you can sometimes break free. And I, I do hope that you're getting to go out and enjoy your day and, and you're, you're getting time with your family. But I do understand that, that this is, um, you know, I think the majority of my students in all of my classes have families um, and uh, work and sometimes other classes. So um, how do we do this, folks? Oh, yeah, we just don't want picnics. Right, right. Okay. Anyways. All right. So in any case, um, uh, I just want to encourage you, though, you know, to keep up uh, from where we're going here. Um, this week's video, you'll notice that I... Um, added a lot more uh, John Green uh, videos into this week and um, I'm debating I may just actually put mostly a documentary also on next week right now I feel like what you should know is that if you've made it this far most of the workload has passed I mean we had this last exam on a week where you still had other assignments to turn in you know, we went through some of the ma the biggest topics, and um, right now we're just getting ready to kind of uh, end on the re Reformation. I'm going to do the next the, the, the next to last week, I'm just going to do a recap and kind of do a discussion thing. Um, you actually are pretty much over the big humps in this class. I can't say the same thing for my cram courses uh, that I have for my uh, other students that um, took the late starts. But for this class, it's really, if you've made it this far, you're good. Now, if you're behind, okay, um, 
this is a time to also take advantage of that, especially after this week. Um, but um, I can only take in so many late papers once we get to the last week. I can't, you know, I need to, uh, I'm going to need to put in all my grades for all of my students, um, you know, in a timely manner. Now, I still haven't got to putting the zeros in um, the, the assignments where you haven't turned in assignments. And that needs to happen. But I just, again, want to remind you that, that if I haven't got to that today, just right. One, it doesn't necessarily mean I won't let you turn in that late work. You need to call me, though, about that, especially if I put a zero. Okay? You have to call me. It won't. Okay? But... The other factor is, is that, um, uh, what was the other factor? See, look at my brain is totally like, okay, wait, what was I going to say? Felt like it was kind of important. Um, the bottom line is just try to get your work done now. I get to a certain point. I think all I think I was, I was trying to say is that, um, I have a deadline in which to turn in grades and I can't get 10 papers assignments from you on the last day. So if you've been behind more than four assignments, right, if you're behind more than four assignments and we have not already been communicating, I need you to call me um, this evening or no later than Tuesday. I work tomorrow 10 hours and I just want to say that I will try to get to anybody. I get texts up. 5 a.m. and uh, 10 at night or later. I'm not mad about those things. Um, I never said not to, but those are probably not the best times to get a hold of me. So let's work with, you know, um, today I'll be available till about 8 o'clock, okay? Then tomorrow I won't be available until I only have like a window, like really between 7.30 and 8.30. But you can text me all throughout the day on my lunch break. I can probably try to help address anything you need to. And then Tuesday is pretty wide open. Okay. Um, so that's all. And um, I want you to feel good and positive and proud about where you guys have been going and how far you've you know, gone in this journey of Western Civ. Um, and, uh, you know, I think I'll just stop talking, stop wasting your time and just say, that I hope that you have a great week and just get out and enjoy yourselves and live life. And that's um, how I'm going to end it.